In this video, I will show you exactly how I made a passive income using ChatGPT and Midjourney to actually design phone cases for me. Uh, so I was able to sell them on Redbubble. So I will show you now step by step how I was able to do this. So I first started in ChatGPT, which I asked to come up with five prompts which were suitable to create trippy AI art in Midjourney. So it came up with the following uh, prompts. Psychedelic landscapes, surreal abstract forms, cosmic realms, fractal dreams, and hypnotic patterns. So for example, we could start with psychedelic landscapes. So we copy it here, go to the mid journey, and we type in, imagine psychedelic landscapes. Uh, let's choose version four. And let's choose uh, stylize 500 to let it use more creativity. All right, so the mid journey bot has finished. So it actually created these four images of Trappy AI art for us. And we could open that in a browser, but we actually want to upscale this image to be a better resolution. So we can actually use it on our phone cases. So let's go to uh, click on variations. And let's see, let's make a variation of image three. All right, so the Midjourney bot has actually finished with the four variations and it looks very good. So let's choose the most beautiful one. Let's choose the second image. So we want to upscale this image. So click on U2 and let's wait for a few seconds. All right, so the Midjourney bot has finished again. And oh, that's the wrong image. So it actually created this image. So we can open it in browser, click save. And after we have saved it, we can actually go to the Redbubble website and go to account, sell your art. And we click on create products, add designs, upload your new work. So we can upload the image which we have just created using the mid journey. And from here, you can start with uh, using a title so for example, we can say uh, trappy AI art uh, landscape. You can uh, come up with some uh, hashtags. So for example, trappy AI art landscape um, psychedelic. Um, and let's have a little description on it. So now we have uh, uploaded our image here and we have made some descriptions. So if you scroll down, you can actually see you have uh, multiple options here. You can use to uh, print it on clothing, for example, a t-shirt or a hat, but you can also make phone cases with it. So if we go to phone cases and skins, we click on edit. And you see now the image is not uh, properly scaled to the outline of the phone case uh, size. So what we can do is choose a pattern, choose regular pattern or offset grid. Uh, let's go with the regular pattern. You can scale the image so it will actually fit the phone case, but let's make it uh, just big enough. You can center it and change something like that. Uh, you can set the background, but let's just keep it this way. And you can, if you like uh, this phone case design, you can apply the changes. And from this on, you can actually uh, start setting up your own store on Redbubble. And this way uh, you are able to sell this art uh, online. But one side note, make sure to buy the uh, fully a premium description of Midjourney, otherwise you could get some problems with actually selling your art. So if you like this video, make sure to subscribe to the channel and I see you in the next one.